Well, here's something really fun we're about to show you this morning. Uh, when you think of car washes, I don't know if you've uh, maybe thought of them quite like Woody's Wash Shack. They are literally changing the game, I think, when it comes to washing your car and really taking care of it. Jenny Beadle, the marketing director, joining us this morning. So good to see you, Jenny. Good morning. Good to see you too, Carly. So uh, I have a family with three kiddos at home. We certainly love going through the car wash, but I have to say, if people are just finding out about Woody's, I mean, it's pretty remarkable how different uh, you and the team are over there. It is. It's a really, it's a cool brand. It's a fun brand. The whole goal is to just make it a fun experience. We want the kids to enjoy coming yeah. through. You know, sometimes that's not the case. Uh, sometimes little kids get a little freaked out by going through the car wash. So we want it to be fun. We want to be the spot where the family's like, oh my God, you know, like, we want people to recognize it. And it's just a feel good brand. It is. Uh, you just opened your second location, right? It started in St. Pete and now there's a brand new location in Tampa. Yep. So we just uh, we just opened our brand new location here on Gandhi Boulevard over on the Tampa side. So it's one block off of West Shore and it is going really well. We've been open officially 30 days now. Oh, congratulations. Thank you. So when I say that you guys are also changing the business when it comes to car washes, too, uh, what I love is this effort and this uh, what you're doing for the community and really giving back. I mean, it's pretty remarkable what you and the team are doing. Doing. Tell us more about this. So Woody's is family owned and operated. Um, it was invented, or I guess that's the right word, invented uh, by a local family here in Tampa. And as a part of the family owned piece of it, we really focus on like old school values. So we're focused on taking pride in what you do, ownership, hustle, courtesy, you know, those kinds of old school values that really kind of have fallen by the wayside in like modern society. Uh, the whole brand is based on the Woody surf wagon from the fifties and sixties, like surf culture, yes. which is really cool. And uh, yeah, so as part of our, you know, family owned and operated old school values, we wanna keep those alive and well well, and we think a big part of that is giving back to the community. So if we are successful, we want other entities in our community to be successful as well. We are specifically interested in supporting kids, in supporting conservation efforts, and in supporting people who are seeking opportunity for their lives. So how do you guys do that? Is it a portion of the, you know, the, the sales that come in? I mean, is it the employees there? How are you guys actually doing this? Um, it's a couple different ways. So we have a partnership with the Pinellas Education Foundation. Okay. And we give back. Um, we had a, a haunted car wash back in October, which was <laughs> awesome because it was COVID friendly. You know, people yeah. Was COVID, it was a haunted house. So it was cool. Um, but we gave a portion of the proceeds back to Pinellas Education for that, for their Take Stock and Children program. Um, we also, we gave a $10,000 gift over the summer to Surfers for Autism, which is a group that actually um, works with kids and adults who have autism and other developmental um, um, delays. And they have learned through research that learning to surf and being in the waves and being in the water actually helps them respond better to, to wow. different, um, yeah. you know, different things that might come their way throughout the day. So uh, we were really big into supporting them. Um, we also right now, February, every single week in February, we have a different school or a different group that is doing fundraisers at our locations. So for example, at the Gandhi location right now, we have the Robbins High School um, PTA group and they are, they have a special code and anybody who goes to the Gandhi location and puts in that code before they purchase a car wash, 10% um, goes back to the Robinson High School PTA. Awesome. Uh, so yes, yeah, so we have a lot of those different kinds of things. We're yeah. still building it out, but it's super cool to be able to give back. All right. So there, the plan is to get a lot of these locations. You know me, I was telling I'm in Wesley Chapel, move up, move up north, which uh, there might be some future plans for that. But tell me about as we get ready to close here, the membership that you really want to make sure people know about because it's really a great value. Right. So I, most people don't think about membership for a car wash, uh, but it's basically we like to call it our Woody's Unlimited Wash Club. So basically it's a monthly fee like you would pay for a gym uh, and you get to wash unlimited times as many times as a month as you want. You could come every single day if you wanted to. And the goal behind the business as a whole is to have so many locations that it's super convenient for you. So if your car gets dirty and yeah. you need to run by school, then you're there. Or if you're by work, there's a Woody's close by. Or if you're going on vacation down to Venice, there's a Woody's close by. So we want, we want it to be an organization that you can really be a member of, be a part of. Um, and then we do a lot of like 
member giveaways and stuff like that. So the St. Pete Grand Prix, yeah. we always have several hundred tickets that we give away to our members. We give away event tickets and um, Woody's goodies, which some of which you see in the background here, we have hats <laughs> and shirts and tank tops and, yeah. yet and all kinds of stuff. So, and real quick, talk about this buck special. Let's give them some love this morning. In honor of number 12, Tom Brady, uh, you can get your first wash, uh, your first month of unlimited washes for 12 bucks, only going on until Sunday the 21st, so you better hurry. All right, so good to see you. So excited to see what Woody's uh, is doing now and what they're going to be doing in the future. We look forward to, to talking with you guys again soon. Okay, Jenny? You too. Thanks, Carly. Have a great day. You too.